Shinyo Lantern Floating Hawaii Ceremony usually occurs at Almoana Beach Park, but this year, the event will once again be held at the Shinyo N Temple because of the pandemic. For one caregiver, she continues to volunteer at the event and remains a shining light. I just felt called to do it. For the past 10 years, Joe DeMarais has volunteered at the Shinyo Lantern Floating Hawaii Ceremony. It's this total experience. And I, I, it's, it's like a meditation. So when I, when I anticipate that I'm going to Shinyo in to volunteer, this just warm feeling comes over me. It's, it's a collection of you know, diverse people with like heart, like mind, coming together for an incredibly wonderful purpose. De Marie's purpose was to always help people, especially after she met Edith Maeda at church in the mid-90s. And we just clicked. We just hit it off. De Marie cared for Maeda, who suffered from severe osteoporosis. I made her a, a pin my badge one time that said, I keep an attitude of gratitude. And she, she was just incredibly thankful for everything. And I, I think that having that as a, a mantra, as a way of seeing the world, has really been important to me. What's also important, the memory she made with Maeda, who passed away in 2009. And the things we did together, I mean, it was just absolutely a fun 10 years of, of, of being with her. We flew around the island on one of the tour helicopters and she giggled the whole time. I mean, it was awesome to, to have that experience with her. Her experience as a caregiver also taught her the importance of self-care. Caregiving is important, but self-care is, is an incredibly important part of that process. When you care for someone, you also have to care for yourself so that you stay in a, in a good space and can provide the care for others. As we approach Memorial Day, Dame Ray will continue to honor her friend with a heartfelt message. When I'm standing there writing the message, it just comes from the heart. I, I don't have a plan or whatever. It just comes from the heart at the moment. We want to thank Dame Marie, and just a reminder, we will be airing a special broadcast of the Shinyo Lantern Floating Hawaii Ceremony next Monday at 6.30 p.m right here on KH12. But I like what she said in terms of an attitude of gratitude. Mm -hmm. And she spoke so highly. It sounded like they had a really great relationship together. And I like what she said. You know, you don't think about it. You plan it. Just what you feel in the moment, then you kind of write your dedication. Yeah. Good story. Thank you, Ross.